Nuria, good night. Hi, teacher. How are you today? Uh, it was busy. Really? How how you have been with your international phone calls? <laughs> no, lo entendí. <laughs> ¿Cómo ha estado con sus llamadas internacionales? Oh, eh, más o menos. Really? Es que estoy en, me trasladaron a otra área. Do you receive any international phone call? Sí, pero son empresas. Oh. Ah, so entonces... maybe you, you can ask to talk with somebody who speaks Spanish. No. Eh, Puede pedir con alguien que habla español, ¿no? Eh, yes. Mm, pero eh, más que todo por emails. Ah, by emails. Okay. Mm, o sea uh, que a mí me serviría bastante la escritura. Now you need the writing. <laughs> sí, que siempre están ocupados o que no. les regrese la llamada. Entonces, ah, okay. es mejor por, por, por emails. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, I no, got igual. it. Es más pesado. Really? But you are earning more. No. <laughs> you are earning a little bit more. Yes. <laughs> okay, come on. So, your smile is it's okay, okay? Ah, that's why. Es, it's very, it's es too heavy. Es bueno, ¿cómo se dice? Eso es lo mejor. Ah, that's the better. That's the best thing or that's the better? That's the better. Better. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Or you say yes. Is the best. Es lo mejor. It is the best. Vanessa, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Dinora, as always, on your coach. <laughs> Your pillow, your coach. Good night, teacher. Good night, Vicky. Mr. Argueta. Uh, Vanessa, what's your full name, Vanessa? Remember that you have to be connected with your full name. What is your full name, Vanessa? ¿Cuál es el nombre completo? Ah, Zaira Vanessa Velázquez Quintero. Ah, ok. Ah, es que no aparece, que ahorita lo voy a arreglar. Ah, va, ok. Ahí. Jorge, again. Please write down your full name, Jorge. Hi, good night. Good night. Write down your full name, please. Mr. Canray Montano, eh, arregle su nombre completo, Jorge, por favor. Write down your full name. Good night, teacher. Good night, yeah. mister. Okay. Yeah. Sara. Good night, teacher. Good night, Sara. How are you today? Esta cosa se me traba. <laughs> Qué terrible, se me traba el micrófono. Terrific. Very good. Very good. Welcome to us how to provide a PPT to review. That's it. Remember, guys, I, I, I imagine that almost all of you have done your two exercises, no? Yes. And also, if you can go to the platform, you are going to see one question every single day. Please answer one question, okay? There is a question on the forum. Uh, be, that is, I know, that is below the video of the class in the platform, and you are gonna find a question, okay? Big uh, Diana and Francisca, good night. Francisca, 
Good night. You are the chosen sure. one today. Do you know that? In serio. Yes, Francisca. So sorry. Who has? Okay. Who has like highest like a? <laughs> I don't remember Hi. how do you say. How do you say that? No sabe que cansada. I imagine Francisca. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Saul, Mr. Beltran, good night. Hi, teacher. Good night. Very good. Jan Siwalu Perazo, good night. And that is Abraham. Abraham, yeah, Abraham has that picture. What is that? What can what, what is that? Is the mask de Totoro. What? Es la máscara de mi amigo Totoro. Ah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. It's an anime. It's a, it's an, it's a good anime. I mean, I think so that is a, it's a good movie, no? No, no movie. Yeah. Yeah. I I I I I haven't seen. I have I have heard that it's a good movie, but I haven't seen it yet. Okay. Four past eight. Okay. Four past eight. We are online. Okay, guys. Let me see. <laughs> okay, today is Wednesday, June 23rd, 2020, 2021. That's it. 2021. Okay. And I'm one that go with the attendance okay attendance let me see america beatriz garcia herrera bernardo javier aquino menéndez no. diana gabriela martinez escobar present teacher Good. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present. Good. Fátima del Carmen Portillo de Hernández. Flor Idalia Turcios Luna. Francisca Yanira Arevalo Rodríguez. Present teacher. Good. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present teacher. Very good. Mauricio Alexander Majano Escobar. Nuria Elizabeth Nerio Vargas. Present teacher. Aris Abraham Rivera López. Present teacher. Rocío Katia Maritza Martínez Cubías. Present teacher. Good. Ruth Joana Alvarado Gaitán. Zaira Vanessa Velázquez Quinteros. Present teacher. Good. Salvador Edgardo Escobar Vázquez. Sara Carolina Jiménez Flores. Present teacher. Saúl Adolfo Beltrán. Present teacher. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Present teacher. Nancy Guadalupe Erazo García. Present. Soy la Claribel Rosales Bernal. Present teacher. Good. I want to see. Yeah. Okay. I think so that everybody's here. Okay, 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 guys. Uh, Joanna, you go for the next one, Joanna, because I have mentioned before. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, as yesterday, we are gonna start with a class that uh, <clears throat> that we studied, that it was about um, ex time expressions, that it was about uh, daily, monthly, and all those kind of things that we have to use. I remember if you couldn't be at class, you can go to the playlist on YouTube and watch the last class. And also I want to remember you that below the class on the platform, you are gonna have a question, please <clears throat> answer the question. And also you have every single day an exercise that you have to do, okay? It means that every single day you, you have to do the exercise and on the morning, I'm gonna post a question on the forum, the, the question that you have to answer. Just you have to write down your, your answer. I think that the, the question for yesterday's class was uh, how, how often do you visit your relatives? I don't know, I mean, how often do you visit your relatives and you say daily, weekly, and monthly, I don't know. It depends on you, the, the answer of the question. The point is that you have to participate uh, on the forum, okay? So after that, I'm gonna share my screen first. So I don't know what happened. Please don't do that. Yeah, as always. Voilà. Yeah. Let's gonna see, yeah, I don't know. I'm working on. I'm working on. Uh -huh. Is it? Let me see, let me see. Well, uh -huh. I'm gonna share a screen, compartir. Sorry. That is, welcome again to the course English for Work program, basic module two. The topic for today is how to use how much and how many. But before we go there, we have to uh, review the topic of yesterday or yesterday's topic that it was uh, mainly time expressions. Inside the time expression that I told you, the most, I mean, the, the central points yesterday was every day, every week, every month, every year, daily, weekly, monthly, annually, okay? Those are the expressions that we can use when we're talking about, as by example, you say, uh, I check my mail every day, and I go to the gym, every week, uh, I go to, to visit my relative every month, okay? Uh, I celebrate Christmas every year. Uh, I don't know, I run, I, I got to run daily. Uh, I go to the supermarket or I buy on the supermarket weekly. Uh, I buy clothes monthly. And I don't know, that's the way to use this kind of expression. And even on, on your work, as by example, I don't know if you have trainings. I mean, you can say, teacher, in my work, I have trainings uh, every week. As by example, you can have a training every week or maybe it could be every month. Mm -hmm. It can be every month or monthly. It depends on you. Okay. And yesterday, I remember that we were working with a page, okay? With a page, I'm gonna stop to, with a page and a, I don't know who didn't ask me about the page, okay? Uh, because I know that some of you did, but some of you didn't. That's why I, I would like to know who didn't and you can ask me now, okay? Joanna, did you ask me yesterday? No, yeah? <laughs> no, me entendió. Okay. Did you ask me yesterday? Me preguntó ayer. Al final de la clase? Yes. Okay. Who didn't ask? Please, Tom, uh, Tom up. 
¿Quién no lo hizo? Me, yes. You, me. yes. Ah, Nuria, ok. Ask me, then, Nuria. Ask me. Ok. Uh, um, do you ever read um, your bed? Do you ever read your? Your bed. My bed. What? Spell it. The last, the last, the last, the last, the last. Spell the last word. Spell. Excuse me. Spell the last word. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Eh, no, esta no. <laughs> Come on. What color are you, pijamas? <laughs> I'm not using pajamas now, but I have one that is blue and the other one is pink. No, I'm I'm kidding. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm kidding. Okay. okay. I just have one blue and one red. Okay, that's okay. Any other, I mean, somebody else that didn't okay. ask me yesterday, thank you. Somebody else didn't ask me yesterday. Yo, Clary, no le pregunté. Okay, ask me, Claribel. Okay. Um, tengo duda en la number. Uh -huh. You, ahorita se le di. 25. Who, 25. Are, uh -huh. Who, Who are loves the, the, the dishwasher? dishwasher? Yes. I mean, the point is that uh, in the USA, uh, there are like machines that they are dishwasher. In this case, it's almost the same to, I mean, to, 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 to wash, to wash the dishes. Who own loves? Quien descarga la máquina lava platos? Okay. Ajá, ¿quién descarga la máquina lava platos? Que sería lo mismo casi que aquí nosotros, ¿quién lava los platos? In the US, at the USA, I mean, in the USA, there are, uh, there are machines. Okay. Somebody you get in the dishes or the plates there, and after, that is, it, it has a process, and after you down, un, un love the, 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 the machine, and after you have the, the dishes cleaned, okay? In Thank my you. case, who wash the dishes? Um, usually my wife, sometimes I do. Okay, thank you, Tish. You're welcome. Okay, any other question? Mm, Who else? Teacher. Janira, very good. Uh, how, how often do you do a sport? Oh, now my, my darling, okay. Now I don't practice too much sport. Maybe no. the, the past year I was doing it every week, weekly. No. I was going. Uh, I was going to to play soccer. Okay. That's I, it. I am like. I am. I like. I am like. I am like a soccer. I I don't like. Or I like. I like. Ah, you like soccer. Very I good. Like soccer, yes. That's why right. soccer is good. Yes. Okay. Somebody else? No more? ¿Qué me faltó ayer? Who's, who missed yesterday? How Nobody else. Work, huh? How long do you work, teacher? How long do you work? I mean... Maybe, uh, let me see, 10 hours, maybe 10 or more, because at work, I work like uh, night hours in my work, night hours uh, per day. And after I have to come here to teach you um, like two hours, two and a half, because I, sometimes I have to prepare material. So maybe like uh, night, 10 hours, it depends, but almost Usually 10 hours. Okay, teacher. 
it's so much time. <laughs> yeah. Teacher, okay. how Bye. long, how long have you been a teacher? Oh my God, how long have you been a teacher? I mean, I have been a teacher since 2000, I mean, since 2006. It means that I have been a teacher for about, let me see, 15 years. Okay. That's it. Do you like your work? Yes, I do. I, lo I love it, you know? Everybody says that I, are, I don't know why, why am I always happy, but I like to teach, even I like languages. I have the goal to learn many other languages like Chinese, like uh, Korean, oh. like Japanese, but uh, that is a goal that I have to reach. And after maybe Portuguese, uh, French, Italian, maybe when I can speak like seven or eight languages, I'm gonna be happy, more happy. <laughs> Very good, teacher. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you. Damn. Okay, guys. I think so that the, the row of questions have finished. We have to go to our topic. As I told you, the topic for today is uh, how to use how much and how, uh, sorry, how much and how many. But before we start to use how much and how many, we have to learn uh, what's the difference between count nouns and non-count nouns, or as somebody called countable nouns and uncountable nouns, okay? So we are gonna go directly to <clears throat> this. This is, okay. I'm gonna start to share with you. Okay. Count nouns, in non-count nouns or countable nouns and uncountable nouns. Which will be, or which are, sorry, the count nouns. The count nouns, they are nouns that can be counted, okay? They can be counted. It means that I don't need a measure to count them. As by example, an apple, it's always an apple. I can say one apple, two apples, three apples, four apples, okay? After, as an example, I have a tomato, okay? One tomato, two tomato, tomatoes, sorry, three tomatoes, four tomatoes, that's it. A sandwich, that is one sandwich, two sandwiches, no son sandwiches, okay? Just like to be clear, no son sandwiches. Uh, they are sandwiches, okay? Como ese, they mean sandwich, sandwiches. Okay, vas a llevar sandwiches. They are sandwiches, okay? One sandwich, two sandwiches, third sandwiches. We can use several. Several means bastantes. Many means bastantes también. Uh, podría decir algunos bastantes sandwiches. A few también es como unos cuantos, ¿ok? Unos cuantos. Uh, entonces, esta es la forma de poder hacer plural con los nombres que pueden ser contados. Pero, that, there are another nouns that they cannot be counted. Ok, just before we got there, says an apple a day is good for you. There is a saying in English that says an apple a day keeps the doctor away, okay? That is a saying in English. Apples are my favorite snack. Apples have a lot of vitamins, okay? Now, the non the non count nouns, they cannot be counted. I mean, can you count the milk? ¿Podemos contar la leche? No. no. Can we count the rice? ¿Puede contar el arroz? No. no, no se va a poner un arroz, dos arroces, tres arroces. No. Ice cream, tampoco. Juice, coffee, cereal, and cheese. ¿Qué pasa con estos? ¿Por qué son nombres incontables para el inglés? 
porque necesitan una medida. Es decir, they need a measure, ¿ok? Necesitan una medida. Es diferente si yo digo a cup of milk, por ejemplo, una taza de leche. A, a pound of rice, por ejemplo. Si yo digo una libra de arroz, a pound of rice, ¿ok? A glass of juice, ¿ok? Un vaso de jugo, ¿ok? A cup of coffee, una taza de café. Uh -huh. Ok, that's the way. Cereal, that is a bowl. Uh, sometimes you use a box or a bowl, a bowl of cereal, ok? Cheese, again, you say a kilo, maybe. That's why you use a measure, ok? Uh, you need a measure to describe uncountable nouns. Almost these nouns, they are used for a full, ok? But they are not used just for food. O sea, son comúnmente usados para comida, pero no son este, exclusivamente de la comida. Por ejemplo, eh, love is an uncountable noun. ¿Ah? ¿Por qué love is un, an uncountable noun? Porque no puedo medir el amor. ¿Ah? Entonces, ideas abstractas como el amor, odio y otras cosas, they are uncountable nouns because they cannot be counted, ¿ok? Ellos no pueden ser contados. That's why they are uncountable nouns. Or noun count nouns. And after we have the nouns that we can count. Okay? Let's gonna see. Here. There you have some examples of countable nouns and uncountable nouns. Okay? You have here vegetable, eggs, Salad, I mean, orange. And after you have uncountable, that is bread, rice, cereal, jam, milk, meat, yeast, coffee, sugar, flour. This is oil, I think so. This is oil. Salt, soup, tea, cottage cheese, uh, pasta, honey, water, cheese, butter, seafood, mustard. Okay. And after countable nouns like Bone, that is a bone, sandwich, apple, orange, burger, fries, eggs, salad, vegetables, cookies, potatoes, tomato, carrot, hot dog, candies, olives, peanuts, pancakes, this is onions, onion, watermelon, pea, grapes, cherries. Those are countable nouns, okay? Let's see, I don't know if I'm gonna move. But uh, the point is that you try to do a sentence using this uncountable noun, okay? Why? Because you can say, oh, I have, I want, I mean, you have to use a measure. Remember, as by example, what are the measures that we use for bread? ¿Cuáles son las medidas que usamos para el pan? Almost you say love. Love. Love is the measure, okay? Love. Por ejemplo, que es una, oh my God, love, que es una rebanada de pan. Esa es la medida que usamos, oh, sorry, yeah. Sorry, sorry, sorry a todos. Porque solo a... Love. Love es una, es the measure that we use for, eh, for the bread. For fruit, we use kilo. I mean, that is kilos. For use, uh -huh, we can use glass. For meat, again, we use kilos. Uh -huh. For rice, we can use pounds. Mm -hmm. For sugar, we can use pounds. For cereal, we can use boxes, by example, for cereal, box, or bowl. For jam, we can use tar, I think so, that is tar, some tarro, por ejemplo, uh, or we can use a spoon, una cucharada. Sorry? A bottle. Uh, a, a, a bottle. What is that? Ah, yeah, a bottle. Yeah, thank you. A bottle. 
exactly a bottle a bottle milk again we can use cup we can use a bottle we can use um what else uh, a cup a bottle uh, a glass of milk coffee again we can use uh, <clears throat> a cup sorry sorry stuff i don't know cacerola ah cacerola para qué para el café no like uh, para hacer un huevo ah but, but in this case no es la medida este para eso es como se dice cacerola es fry o fry pan algunos dicen fry o fry pan que es la cacerola eh, de freír fry pan pero en este caso, como dices, para hacer un huevo. Pero aquí estamos ahorita en las medidas. Por ejemplo, ¿qué medidas usamos para la harina? The floor. Again, we can use a, 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 maybe a cup of flour, a cup and a spoon, as by example. And for oil, again, a bottle. I mean, for salt, we can use what, what was a pound, again, a pound of salt. And a little bit of salt. Pound, sorry, pound, that is pound. Soup, we can use a plate, un plato, por ejemplo. Uh, plate of soup. For coffee, we use, for tea, we use cup. Cottage cheese, I, we use kilos again. Just a question, do you know what is the cottage cheese? Have you ever, have you ever eaten? Ya ha comido queso cottage? Yes, teacher. Yes, who says yes? Yes. Yes. ¿Cuál es? Which is? Ilustrenos, please. O han comprado y dice queso cottage. Es parecido en Exacto, en Spanish es parecido. No, es requesón. Es requesón. Es requesón. Si había comido queso cottage muchos años de su vida y no sabía qué se es, pues, today is, el requesón es el queso Sorry. cottage. Es que, es que si va uno al súper, ahí dice queso, ajá, cottage. Depende. Pero si piden el mercado, lo van a sacar. Pues requesón. <risa> Ahí en el mercado de que son. Yeah, that's it. Ok. Ok, ¿qué es el Pasta, I mean, could be a bowl. Puede ser un bowl. Puede ser a pound, I think so. Eh, uh -huh. What else? A plate, maybe. Un plato. It depends. Honey, again, a spoon. A spoon of pasta, water could be a glass, bottle, 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 butter, butter, but it's a bar, I think so. I don't know, ajá, no me recuerdo, pero si es una barra, creo, de mantequilla. Es como la margarina. Ajá. I think so that, uh, let, just let me Greg, I mean, just I want to see in English, just to see a uh -huh, bar, that is a bar, bar is a, the measure, bar, that is like a, you buy a bar of butter, okay. Seafood again, that is the seafood pound, maybe kilos, pound, pound, kilos. For the other one, that is for uncountable nouns, okay? That is for uncountable noun. I mean, now, uh, <clears throat> this is um, how you use, but the topic is not about. Uh, I mean, it's not just about uncountable and uh, countable and uncountable nouns. 
the main point here is the next one is how to use how much and how many okay how do we use how much and how many but i be, i started before with countable and uncountable noun to understand that how much and how many we have to use with a countable and uncountable noun how much is used for uncountable noun and how many is used for countable noun okay and we say when we want to know the quantity or amount of something we ask questions starting with how much and how many how much i want to know the quantity or amount okay let me see okay how much plus uncountable noun okay and look at here how much sugar sugar oh honey honey how much sugar would you like how much sugar would you like okay how much how much time do we have to finish it's the question that you have to use when you are working on the exercise teacher how much time do we have to finish we have to finish oh my god a thunder near to my house <laughs> did you listen guys yes no yes it was a thunder okay but thanks to god for the god's sake nothing happened Okay, how much time do we have to finish? How much money did you spend? How much milk is in the fridge? Okay, this is how much is for uncountable nouns, okay? Is for to, to know the quantity or amount. And also the most important way to use is to know the price of something. How much? plus singular or, or plural noun, or with the verb cost or be. How much is the dress? Huh? Cuánto ese vestido, así como cuando va al mercado, cuánto por ese vestido? How much is this dress? Okay. How much are these shoes? Okay. How much are these shoes? Cuánto valen esos zapatos? How much did your jacket cost? Aquí tenemos el otro verbo, mire. ¿Cuánto costó tu chaqueta? How much will it cost me? Cuando le van a prestar algo, ¿cuánto me va a costar? How much will it cost me? ¿Ok? Cuando le hacen un favor, ¿y cuánto me va a costar? You know? <laughs> How much? Estas deberían de guardarlas y escribirlas bien para cuando se las pregunten, ¿ok? <laughs> I'm, I'm just kidding. After how many, we use how many, ¿ok? How many is... Again, to know the quantity or amount of something, okay? Para precios solo usamos how much. Uh -huh. Para precios solo usamos how much, okay? Independientemente si es singular o plural, okay? Independientemente, solo que usamos primero el verbo cost o el verbo be. Eso, pero how much is for the prices, ok? How many y how much también ha, son usados para saber la cantidad o la, o sea, o el monto o, o, o la cantidad, la cantidad, quantity or amount. Pero how many is used with countable noun, ok? How many plus plural countable noun, ok? How many days are there in January? How many days are there in January? How many students are in this room? How many books did you buy? How many cousins do you have? Uh, the noun is often omitted in the question where it's obvious what we are talking about. Esto es algo que tienen que saberlo. Que nosotros omitimos el nombre en la pregunta cuando es obvio de lo que estamos hablando, ¿ok? Por ejemplo, usted dice, aquí el, el ejemplo, alguien dice, I would like to buy some cheese, me gustaría comprar algún queso. Entonces, usted ya no dice cuánto queso te gustaría comprar, sino cuánto te gustaría comprar sin queso. How much would you like? 
¿Cuánto te gustaría? Ve aquí. I need. Se lo voy a decir yo. I need some coins. Y aquí dice. How many do you need? ¿A qué se refiere aquí? How many do you need? ¿Cuántas va a querer? A las coins. Exacto. ¿Cuántas va a querer? A las coins. Lo mismo aquí. I need some sugar. How much do you need? ¿A qué se refiere? Sugar. Exactly. A uh, sugar. Oh, honey, honey. That's it, guys. Okay. That's the way to use how much and how many. Okay. Questions here. Questions. No question. No question. Oh, teacher. Ah, no. Everybody is clear? Yes. Yes, teacher. Excellent. Yes, yes, smart yes, guys. Yes. Smart guys. Smart students. Okay. So. Hmm? Can I let, because I see that Sarah is like copying like the students in the school. No, teacher, don't erase the board, please. No, <laughs> no yet. <laughs> I mean, teacher. that's it. Hi. I, I don't need a, a say how much is the cost, only how much is this dress, for example. Yes, because, I mean, how much is the cost is when you know the object also. Uh-huh. How much does it cost? Es la pregunta exacta. Cuando yo ya sé a lo que me refiero. Por ejemplo, usted dice, hey, ¿y ese vestido? O bien puedo decir, how much is that dress? O is this dress? O how much does it cost? Da igual. Pero porque yo puedo decir eso cuando ya sé qué es it. ¿Me entiende, Rocío? El it toma el lugar del vestido, por ejemplo. Okay. Ajá, entonces eso es, yo puedo decir how much does it cost, ah. pero cuando ya sé a qué me refiero. Pero si yo digo how much does it cost, usted, yo le podría preguntar what, el qué. ¿Ah? Pero si yo ya sé, por ejemplo, usted pregunta un llavero ¿ah? o una guitarra, a guitar. Ah, entonces la siguiente pregunta es how much does it cost, cuánto cuesta eso. Pero porque ya sé qué es eso. You got it, Rocío? And, and when you want to know the price, you use how much every, every yeah, uh, yeah, example. Yeah because, in, yeah, because in the price, the question is how much always. Teacher? How much? Hi, Fatima. I don't know. It's, wait, Fatima. Rocío, is it clear for you? No yes, much. Not too much. <laughs> Not, Not too much. much. <laughs> okay. How much is always for prices, Rocio? That's it. How much is always for prices? Okay. It depends. Ya sea, ya sea contable, yeah. ya sea contable o incontable. Exacto. Cuando yo quiero saber el precio de algo is how much. Uh, always. Okay. Pero cuando quiero Thank saber you, la teacher. cantidad, entonces sí es how much or how many, dependiendo de contable o no contable. Okay. Fatima, question? No question, Tisha. Hmm. Okay. Any, Thanks. somebody else? Do you have questions? Come on, I start. Questions, guys? Question, 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 question. No question. Is it clear everything? Yes, sir. Yes. Thank you, Bernardo. Okay, if I think so that everything is clear, so we can ask some questions, okay? We can ask some questions. You start to ask me some question as if you're gonna buy whatever, okay? Prices, and also if you want to know the quantity, okay? If you want to know the prices of my books, of my camera, or everything that I have, okay? You can start to ask 
how many do you have how much i mean how much water do you have i don't know but i, I mean the point is try to use uh the question por favor no me vaya a preguntar cuánto dinero tiene que ahí sí le voy a decir que es muy personal okay <laughs> please okay Star, Bernardo, can you ask me something? Using yes, how sir. much and how many, okay? Okay. Uh, teacher, how many Hi. books do you have? Excellent. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe more than a hundred. Maybe more than a oh, hundred. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Tell me. What, okay. what kind? Of, uh, what kind of book is your favorite? It's my, are my favorite, I'm my favorite. Okay, my favorite books are uh, books that talk about adventures, historical Adventure. events, and that kind of stuff. Fabulous, great. Okay, you're welcome, Mr. Aquino. Mrs. Duran. Hi, teacher. Hi, Mrs. Duran. Um, teacher, how many uh, t-shirts have, or how many have t-shirts? Come on, how many t-shirts, what? Uh, how many uh, have t-shirts? Ah, how many tears do you have? Uh -huh, how do many tears do you have? Okay. Maybe uh, about 25 or something. Mm -hmm. It cheers. That is cheers. Cheers. Okay. Yes. Uh, that's it. Cheers. Okay. La teca si no se pronuncia es shirt. Es algo así como shirt. shirt. Okay. Ajá. Uh -huh. Mr. Candray. Yeah, teacher. Uh, how many days a month do you practice the soccer? Uh, well, now not much but before four days a month every every single uh, every single sunday yeah every single sunday i was going to play soccer at seven o'clock at seven o'clock yes all right thanks you're welcome miss eraso hi teacher hi um how much did your book how much cost how, how much, much did, does did your oh, book cost oh, but, but, does okay. si es solo uno y si son varios es do how much do your book do your books cost okay okay how much do you books. how much how much do you do your book no, Cost. do your book. Do you, no, do Cost. your books, porque estamos hablando de oh. varios. Si es das your book, es solo uno. Recuérdese que okay. das es para una cosa y do es para varias cosas. Entonces, how much do your books cost? Ok, how much do your books cost? <laughs> I don't know. I have to calculate maybe. I don't know how much money do I have here. That's a good question. <laughs> maybe more than more than thousand, maybe. Okay. More than thousand because some of them uh, I have spending fifteen dollars and imagine, yeah, yeah, maybe more than thousand. I don't know, more than thousand. <laughs> oh my God, but I love my books. <laughs> Saul Beltran. Hi, teacher. Hi, Mr. Beltran. Uh, how many years of speaking English? Ah, uh, how many years? 
have you been? Esa pregunta es difícil. Es una estructura que más o menos no manejan, pero se las voy a vender ahorita. How many years have you been? Esto es cuántos años ahorita. ¿Cuántos años has estado? Y de ahí le ponen algo. La estructura la van a ver muy adelante, pero es algo así. Oh, okay. How many years have you been? ¿Cuántos años has estado, por ejemplo, viviendo con tus padres? ¿Cuántos años has estado trabajando? ¿Cuántos años haces solo que es eh, otro de este eh, lleva otro completo? Pero entonces es Sí, es que no, no hay forma de hacer esa pregunta, Beltrán, Mr. Beltrán. ¿Qué me quiere preguntar? Uh, practice English. How many uh, practice? How many years? Years practice English. Uh -huh. Ajá. Vamos a ponerla más fácil. How many years? Eh, sí, pero es que no hay. Vamos a tratar de cambiarla. Es how many years? Sí, pero es que, bueno, ni modo. No los quiero confundir, pero en este caso sería la siguiente es uh, Let me see practicing. Es que esto lleva ya un complemento de pasado, eh, donde de, de continuo el ING. Eso es how many years en este caso es years how many years have you been practicing English? Así sería how many years have you been practicing English? ¿Cuántos años has estado practicando inglés? Okay. Maybe, y ya para contestar también, se usa since, si yo digo el año, y si digo la cantidad, digo for. Eh, ejemplo, Sara creo que es la que ve los vinos. Sara sabe que en las botellas dice since, que dice de cuándo el vino ha estado añejado. Uh -huh. Entonces, en este caso, en my case, uh, since 2004, when I, when I When I, as, when I started to study English. Fue desde el 2004, when I started to study English. Cuando empecé a estudiar inglés, that I started to speak English. Okay, okay. thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Sara Carolina Jiménez. Teacher. Um, teacher, how many could uh, the coffee hit a drink a day? Uh, how many cups of coffee? Very good. Do you, en ese caso sí puedo preguntar, do you drink? ¿Sí? A ver, hágame la pregunta otra vez. How many cups of coffee do you drink a day? Ok. Teacher, uh, how many cups of coffee do, do, do you drink a day? Exactly. Or do you drink per day? Maybe I love coffee, Sarah, but I cannot drink much just to maximum three. I love coffee, but I cannot drink too much. I have to take care of my health. After 40, it's very hard. <laughs> Just to know that I have more than 40, okay? Jorge, Prince, Al Prince. Jorge. <laughs> okay yeah. You have to be very careful what you eat, what you drink, even what you, even what you see. Jorge Alfredo Argueta. <laughs> Hi, teacher. Hi. Um, mm -hmm. How many like to read books? How many? Like to read, to ah, read, read pero books? Que, lo que pasa es que ahí es, <coughs> si ahí es, es like, like es. Gusta. Mm -hmm. Ah. Gusta. Perfecto, pero ahí muy bien, Jorge. Solo que lo único es que no es how many. ¿Cuál sería ahí? How much. Exacto. ¿Cuánto? How much do you like to read books? How much do you like? Okay. Exacto, porque like, o sea, algo de gustar es una idea abstracta, no puede ser medida. No es many. How much do you like to read books? ¿Cuánto te gusta leer libros? Esa es. Um, how much do you like to read books? How much do you like to read books? 
I love it. I love it. I don't know. I think so that I have, I have read more than, maybe more than 50 or more than 100. Todos los que ve ahí, creo que, de verdad, creo que solo como dos tengo a mitad, pero de ahí todos, aunque no lo crea, los he leído. Y eso, aparte de los que me han prestado, aparte de los que he impreso, el último que estaba leyendo, bueno, los últimos dos que leí, they have 60, 600 pages. The first one and the other one has 400 pages. No es por hacer alarde, pero eran como mil hojas. I like. <laughs> okay, Zaira. Uh, hi, teacher. Hi. How many, uh, how many cigarettes do you have? How many? How many, how, how many siblets uh, do you have? Siblets. Siblets. Siblet. Siblings. Ajá. Uh -huh. Siblets son, recuérdenme, what's the meaning of siblets, guys? Very good. You are asking, you are making, I have to ask you. Uh huh. What's the meaning of siblet? Mm -hmm. Hey, help me. What's the meaning of siblet? Siblet? Yes, siblet. What is the meaning of siblet? How many siblet? Do you have? Siblet, 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 siblet. No. Siblet. Spell it, Zaira. Deletrelo. Siblings. Ah, mm -hmm. siblings. Thank you. Siblings. Ah, okay. Yes, hermanos. Ah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, not only has three siblings. Thank you, Rocio. Yeah. I have two brothers and one sister. That's it. Thank you, Zaira. Thank you, Rocio. Siblings, yeah. Joanna? Hi, teacher. Hi. <clears throat> How many years have You've been working as a teacher. Very good. How many years have you been working as a teacher? Uh, uh, about 17? Uh, no, about maybe, sorry, about 15 years. Yes. I have a long career. Yeah. And I am still on my 40. Imagine that I am still missing like 20. I'm going to get 35 years teaching English. I have I have met a lot of people like you. Yeah, Joanna. Mr. Mahano. Thank you, Joanna. How many children do you have? Ah, I have two girls. I have two children. I have two girls. Okay. How many girls do you have? How many? No. En ese caso, para eh, eh, preguntar años, Mauricio, es la expresión común, básica. How old? How old are you? Y si es acerca de ellos, es how old are they? ¿Cuántos años tienen ellos? How old are they? How old es la expresión para preguntar, no how many. How many years? No, no se pregunta con edad, Mauricio. Es how old. Ok, oh, Mauricio. Ok. Very good. Veamos, veamos. Fátima ya me preguntó, yes, no? No. Ok. No, no yet. How Very many, good. How many students do you have in this course? Uh, well, always I have to have 20, but always I have like 18 or, or, or yeah, but I have 20. I mean, the, every 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 course is with 20 students. Yeah, thank you. Okay. Diana? How many English books have you read? Uh, 
if you count books of grammar, many. If you have, if you have to count book just for pleasure, maybe like four. Even I think so that I'm, I'm, I'm reading the last one that I'm reading in English is the women are from Venus and men are from Mars. Yeah, that's the last one that I'm reading in English. <laughs> okay. ¿Y cuál me I recomienda? Huh? ¿Y cuál me recomienda? In English. No, I mean, yes. there, 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 there are many. Um, the, el, eh, lo que pasa es que en internet hoy hay un montón de aplicaciones. There are a lot of applications. Okay. But I don't know what kind of books do you like. No sé uh, qué clase de libros le gusta leer. Ahora... Hay, no sé si en internet están obras como la de Sherlock Holmes. Hoy hay, hay, hoy hay obras resumidas como la de Sherlock Holmes, este, uh, Tom Sawyer, y hay un montón de pequeños libros. If you want my recommendation, if you live here in San Salvador, uh, you can go to, <clears throat> to, to the places where they, uh, where they sell uh, secondhand things. Cosas de segunda mano y ellos tienen libros 50 centavos, un dólar, un libro de inglés. Okay. So, it's a good, I mean. Interesting. Yeah, it's like an offer. <laughs> That's why. Okay. Todos los que he comprado, okay. los compro ahí porque aquí nadie tiene una, una biblioteca en inglés. O sea, todos los que he comprado los he comprado ahí porque sé que ellos, ¿quién llega a comprar? De hecho, con que no compran ni libros en español, menos en inglés. <laughs> Cierto. <clears throat> Teacher, no. Hi. Where did you buy the, the, the books? I mean, Genesis, La Escalón. Uh, it depends. Almost all the all the all the places that uh, sell things on second hand, they have at least one or two. Todos los lugares que venden de segunda mano tienen al menos uno o dos libros por allá donde nadie le hace caso a 50 centavos a un dólar. O sea. De verdad, vaya un día solo por eso y yo mire allá donde nadie le hace pero ni, donde ni, ni las moscas llegan en esos lugares. O sea, you are going to find a book. Flor. Hi, teacher. Hi, Flor. Uh, how much do you like the cold? How much do you like? The cold. What is cold? Spell it. El frío. Ah, how much do you like cold? Yeah. Cold, yeah. Cold. No es, y no pronuncia la L. Cold. I like it, but it's dangerous for me. I mean, always like uh, you have with, uh, with my news and, and, my, um, and my throat. I mean, I suffer, but I like, I like too much. You know how much I like that. The call. I, I I think that everybody likes call instead of hot. Thank you. Soila Claribel. Hello, teacher. Hi. How many pictures do you have in your house? Okay, maybe I have like uh, a few, maybe like three of my family and me. Yeah, three, three or four, maybe. The other pictures, they are, they are, they are kept in a box. My, okay. my wife has a lot of pictures. I mean, his dad was a photographer and he has like, a, <laughs> I don't know how many boxes, maybe like four or, or five boxes, just uh, filled out with pictures of her family. Thank you. Okay, America, nice to see you, America. Good night, teacher. Good night. Eh, ¿Le gustaría oír o cree que me puede preguntar ya, América? Mm, voy a escuchar, teacher. Vaya, me faltan dos, creo. Yanira, tres, creo. Yanira. Sí, teacher. Ajá. Um, how many how many of fails um how many how, what? Many, how many pairs choose ah, do you pair have? Of shoes do you have i mean very good question like one two three like four maybe 
Oh. The Father's Day, they gave me uh, one pair of Converse girl shoes. I like it. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, what colors? Ah, they are, are gray. They are gray. Okay. Because uh, just as a secret, pero que nadie oiga, Janira, it's very <laughs> hard for me to find shoes <laughs> because uh, really? I am, a, yeah, my size is very, it's very big. That's why, but it's just a, sec just a secret. I cannot go whatever place because I suffer. <laughs> okay. okay. Rocio. Hello, teacher. Hello, Rocio. And how many pets in your house do you have? I don't have pets, Rocio. Sorry, I don't have pets uh, here. Yeah. Why? First, first of all, because I, I am allergic to cats. First of all, I'm allergic to cats. Uh, I mean, you can see my eyes, they start to, 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 to be like a red, like, like a red, and I start to uh, to sneeze, I think so, to sneeze, sneeze. that is, sneeze. Uh -huh, exactly, to sneeze, I think so, that is a sneeze. I start to sneeze. That's why I cannot have cats. And maybe, and, and right now I don't like to have parrots or something like that because I think so that it's very, I don't like, it's very inhuman even for animals. I don't like that they are like jail. No me gustaría que ellos estuvieran encerrados. I mean, that's my point of view. Okay, thank you, teacher. Abraham, question Abraham. How many works do you have, teacher? <laughs> just two, Abraham, just two. I mean, uh, I'm, the, I'm, I'm the principal in an institution and I'm a teacher of English uh, for Inglés Corporativo here. Okay, that's it. <laughs> okay. Okay, somebody else, no, everybody has passed. I mean, we can go to the Attendance, okay? Attendance, attendance, attendance. Okay, America Beatriz Garcia Herrera. Present teacher. Very good. Bernardo Javier Aquino Hernán Menéndez, perdón. Bernardo Javier Aquino. Ah, he's the one, huh? Leonardo. Oh my God, he has problem with the. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, no. That's why. Hmm. Yeah, uh, no, 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 vamos. Fátima del Carmen Portillo Hernández. Present. Floridalia Turcios Luna. Present. Mauricio Alexander Majano Escobar. Present. Ruth Joana Alvarado Gaitán. Present teacher. Very good. Salvador Edgardo Escobar Vasquez. Ah, he was, he's not. Okay. Okay. Now that we have go for the attendance, we have time to go for uh, the worksheet. Okay. As always, I'm going to share the worksheet that you have to work first. I will explain also. In the first part, you have to uh, complete if it's how much or how many. That's the first thing that you have to do. And also, you can ask between yourselves. And the second part, you can, uh, you can, you can, you, you have to ask about yourself. Okay, I mean, you have to, you have to answer about yourself. Let me see. And after, uh, and after, you can share the question. And after, you can, uh, you can ask between yourselves. As always, please participate. Please remember, uh, try to cooperate with the learning of, the, of everybody. I mean, if you know a little bit more than your classmate, your coworker, please, I mean, share your knowledge, okay? The first one, complete questions using the correct option from above. In this case, ignore. That is just how much or how many, okay? And after, read, uh, read uh, ask, 
to your ask to your classmate, sorry, that's how many grandparents do you have? Okay, how many legs does a spider have? Those are the questions you have to ask uh, to your classmate, okay? Okay, how many people are there in your family? Ah, there are maybe four, I don't know. How many fingers do you have? I imagine that everybody has 20, okay? How much does a can of Pepsi cost? I don't know. I mean, those are the questions, okay? Everything is okay? Everything is clear? Yes, thumb up, please. Yes. Thumb up? Yes, yes. Okay. Thumb up, like the yes. scissor, okay? Live or death? Live. <laughs> <laughs> okay, live. Okay, you have to get, you can get in. You have to get in everybody, okay? Salvador is not here. America, Fatima, y Rocío, you haven't got in. Rocio, where are you now? You have to go to your breakout room, Rocio. Oh, thank you. Okay. Eh, do, okay. Recordando in, in Spanish un, a moment. Lo que vamos okay. a hacer es eh, solamente eh, Colocar la estructura correcta, primero en la, en, la, en, la, en la primera parte y en la segunda parte, pues contestar la, la pregunta. Exacto, pero contestarla asking to your classmates, ¿ok? Contestando la pregunta a sus compañeros, no importa, o sea, obviamente no voy a manchar la hoja, pero usted puede ponerle la, el número de pregunta a uno y a quién le preguntó y qué le respondió, porque, por ejemplo, en algunas preguntas sí son bien puras como cuántas, cuántas piernas tiene una araña, esa, eh, esa pregunta es obvia. Pero, por ejemplo, la número tres, ¿cuántas personas hay en tu familia? Esa ya varía para cada quien. No creo que usted tenga los mismos miembros que tiene Saúl, ni los que tiene América, ni los que tiene Diana. Entonces, ok, pero that's the point, ok? You have to ask between yourself asking in English. Eh, exacto, en la primera es solo how much and how many, ok? Ok. okay. We need to identify to the accountable. Contable now. Okay. Yeah, identify. First, identify. 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 Okay. The first student are there in your classroom. I think about uh, how many students are there in your classroom. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> no, I. Number and number five. Oh, no, number five. Two. Five. Yes. How much, uh -huh. Neil? How much? Go like with your cookies. Would you How like? Much? Good like. Would. 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 How many? No. Las L generalmente oh. en medio de las de, de todas las letras en inglés casi casi nunca se pronuncian. No se pronuncian. O sea, son aspiradas. Would. Ajá, would. es would. would. How, like. many, how much meal would you like with much? cookies? Oh. Okay. No, y la última y la otra se van preguntando entre ustedes, ¿verdad? Ok. Yes, teacher. Ok. Mm -hmm. Carrot um, is. Number six. There in the classroom. Ajá, uh -huh, es. How many students are there in your classroom? Yeah, exactly. How many students are there in your classroom? 20. 20, well. Yeah. You don't have to answer, but if you want to answer, very well. Okay, in the second part, you have to ask between yourselves, okay? Tiene que preguntarse entre ustedes. Okay? Hay preguntas que son obvias, como por ejemplo, ¿cuántas piernas tiene una araña? Eso es más que obvio, a menos que usted conozca otros tipos. 
¿Ah? Pero, por ejemplo, la tercera, que es cuántos miembros hay en tu familia, esa creo que difiere para cada uno, ¿no? O sea, no creo que Jan si tenga los mismos que Zaira, ni que Jorge, ni que Mauricio. ¿Aquí? Entonces, ese tipo de preguntas vayan, este, igual, no importa que repitan que porque lo, es la misma respuesta a la de la araña, o sea, el punto es que vayan speaking in English, ¿ok? okay y la de arriba sería how many or how much. Exactly. How many and how much. Ok. Vaya, entonces sería How many strawberries are in your plate? How, how many strawberries are in your plate? How yes. many strawberry, strawberries are in your plate? Yeah? Ok. There's how many? Three. How much water? How much water? Yeah. Yes. And the last mm -hmm. one you have to uh, you have to ask between yourselves, okay? In la última si tienen que preguntar entre ustedes, okay? Y no se aburran second igual. Second. Yeah, y no se aburran. Okay. Y si miren, de verdad, se acabaron las preguntas, ya me pregunté las 10, 15 y ahora qué hacemos? Inventen nuevas, usen su lenguaje, usen lo que ya han aprendido, busquen nuevas palabras, no vayan a estar aquí como que y hoy qué hacemos? Es que ya las hicimos todas las de la página, teacher. Please, okay? I beg you. Okay. La primera, ¿cuántos estudiantes hay en tu clase? Come on. Ah, oh my god. Sí. They are, my, my, my ears are bleeding. Mis oídos están sangrando. I listen to you speaking in Spanish, Dinora. No, es que estábamos explicando por cuál es, qué significa how many y por qué se utilizan. Entonces, ¿por qué oh, no le voy a poder explicar uh -huh. todititito eso a, a Flor? Ah, sí. Flor, sí. Ok, Ajá. but you got it, Flor? Eh, sí, bueno, ella me dijo de how, how much y how many. Los dos significan cuánto. How much es para lo incontable y how many para lo contable. Así es, básico. Okay. Luego en la segunda parte se preguntan entre ustedes. Y si se llegaran a preguntar las 16 preguntas, ¿qué van a hacer? Seguirnos inventando más preguntas. Esa, I like it, Vicky. That's the attitude, ¿ok? Ok. Number six, dijimos, ¿verdad? Number six. Eh, uh -huh. uh, Aquí. Ajá. Ah. Question two es. Uh, spider, araña. Spider. Spider. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah, uh -huh. spider. You've never heard Spider-Man, 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 Spider-Man. Okay, come on. Spider, yeah, el hombre araña, Spider-Man. This is a good question because I don't know how many eggs. Legs. Uh, I mean, eggs. commonly, commonly, they have eight. Commonly. Eight. <laughs> but it depends of the type. I think so that almost all of them son arachnidos. Almost the, all of them, they have eight. Almost or, all of them. But maybe... Or, Depend of the spider too. Exactly, that's why. Depend of the spider, but at least almost the the kinds of spider that we know, they have eight. Maybe there are another kind of spider that maybe we don't know. There is a study that uh, there are like uh, eight million of animal species between insects and this, and we, the human being, Just we have classified 1.5 million. O sea que solo hemos clasificado 1.5 de 8 millones de especies de animales, insectos y todo lo que hay. 6.5 millones todavía no han sido clasificados. That's why. But according to the question, we can imagine that the spiders have eight legs. Okay? okay. Cuando se terminen okay. las preguntas, ¿qué van a hacer? ¿Qué van a hacer cuando se terminen las 16 preguntas? Diana y América ya lo saben qué tienen que hacer, Diana y América. No. Inventar uh, más. We made, we made another question. We have to make, yes, ever. Very good. We have to make another question. Ok. NT. Okay. NT. What is up? Tenemos decir 65 centavos. Centavos. 
Ah, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50 no, 60, 65, 65 cents. 65 cents. Oh, okay. Yeah, 65, 65 cents. cents. Okay, yeah. Sarita, 65 cents. Okay. Yeah, 65 Be cents. Sure. Thank you. Hi. Be sure. It can be also pennies. Yeah, also pennies. Yeah, pennies. Okay. Excuse me. Pennies is, a, pennies is also the word. Uh, the point is that Zen is more uh, American and pennies are more Brit British. That's the difference. British. Uh -huh. okay. Then they are British, like penny, dimes, as by example. You know what is a dime? Oh, uh, no. Ten cents. Ten cents is a dime. Si se ve en la moneda y de a diez, dice one dime. Uh -huh. Like this, son diez centavos. Uh huh. Okay. That's okay. why. Okay. When you finish the question, what will, what will you do? No, no, no. 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 Sí. no sí. Sí. Las preguntas que van a hacer. Vamos a platicar. Yes. <laughs> yes. Van a platicar usando el inglés y creando nuevas preguntas en inglés, yes. please. Okay. okay. <laughs> yes, teacher. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> who was who what who who's good the good huh? teacher tenemos Hi. una pregunta pero se la voy a decir en Spanish oh, come on but tell me ok <laughs> vaya solo para saber que estamos claros con how many y how much ah, ok how many lo utilizamos para eh, para el plural. Ah, no, no, no. Pero lo que se puede contar. Ah, sí, para el plural, pero que es un, un contable. Ajá. Y el how much lo, lo utilizamos para los contables, pero que no se puede Para contar. los uncountables. Pero, perdón, para los uncountables, pero lo singular. Lo que pasa es que los uncountables casi siempre son singulares. Esa es la diferencia. Ajá. O sea, es decir, el arroz siempre va, o sea, va a ser arroz, por ejemplo. Es decir, uh -huh. por eso es que siempre son singulares. No le den mucho espacio a eso porque se va a terminar confundiendo. Ok. Eh, se va, o sea, si se mete deeply y se va a terminar así como, no es que no lo sé, pero eh, yo siempre he dicho, y eso no es nada así, enfóquese más en el lenguaje. Por ejemplo, how much, como usted dice, para los que no puedo contar. ¿Ah? Y para precios. Por ejemplo, uh -huh. how, much, uh, how much milk would you like? Creo que ahí hay una pregunta que es así, ¿verdad? How, mi ¿Sí? how much milk, por ejemplo. Exacto. How much milk would you like? ¿Cuánta leche te gustaría? En ese caso es how much porque igual, ¿no? O sea, es, es un uncountable. How much milk would you like? How much coffee te gustaría? ¿Cuánto café te gustaría? How much coffee do you drink per day? ¿Cuánto café bebe usted por día? How much coffee do you drink per day? Okay, uh, uh, it's, it's question for me. Yeah, it's a question. Yeah, how two, much coffee? Yeah, what? Two cup, two cup coffee. Two cups of coffee, ¿vale? Entonces, eso, ¿vale? ¿Por qué? Porque por, how much es para los que no puedo contar, ¿ok? Ya usted oh. ya le pone una medida cuando le pregunta. Entonces, y how many es para los que puedo contar, ¿ah? Por ejemplo, cuando dice peppers, que son como pimientos, how many peppers? Okay. Okay. Ya les di la respuesta para que vean, pero qué barbaridad. O en la primera, how many students, por ejemplo, que es algo uh -huh. que puedo contar. How many students. How many strawberries. Exactly. Many Exacto, Jancy. Yeah. Sí. Entonces, le va a ser más fácil que, o sea, yo tengo que explicarlo todo, pero ya le va a ser más fácil que, mire, este singular, este plural. De hecho, si va a la teoría, se va a dar cuenta que so, hay nombres que son ambos, son contables y son incontables. Entonces, Va a decir, hey, teacher, mira, ¿qué pasó? Entonces, mejor step by step, ¿ok? Ok. Va, ok. Ok. Bueno. Vaya, vamos a las siete. Ah, ¿qué es Joyce? Joyce. ¿Es ¿Dónde? Jugo. Ah, juice. 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 Ah, ok. Juice, can you drink? Juice, yeah. Nunca vieron la película. Beat el juice, beat el juice, beat el juice. Jugo de... No, yo no. Jugo de, jugo de mosquitos. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. 
Okay. Yo soy como un guerrero cuchillo de palo, no he visto películas. <risa> y menos mal que tiene un canal, qué bárbaro. <risa> That's why, I believe it, ¿ok? Mm. What about here? Just Joanna and Fatima. Who was with you here? Ah, uh, Zaira, no? but maybe he Rocío, connected, no. connected. Rocío was, but. Ah, Rocío was. Okay. Uh -huh. I don't know what happened to Rocio. Mm. Ah, she's here again. Esta, ¿Cuál sala son ustedes? La tres, ¿qué son? La cuatro, ¿verdad? Yes. Mm. Uh, I don't know which yeah, cuatro. La cuatro son. Where... Ah, perfecto. She's here again. Uh, okay. Maybe she's having problem with the internet. Any problem? No. Question? Doubts? Jokes? And we are in the question number seven. How mm -hmm. many countries are there? How many countries? Deje los números, hombre. Pregúntenselo así. Deje los números de lado y solo. Eh, how many? Okay. Y va inventando esas preguntas, por ejemplo. Uh, how, okay. many languages, about, how many languages they are speaking about around the world? 100. <laughs> countries. Uh, countries. Okay. Countries. Países, ¿cuántos hay? Uh -huh. Nacionalizados, más o menos 182. Pero de ahí hay otros que no están todavía. Y que están peleando uh -huh. algunos, por ejemplo, eh, si son nacionales o si son extranjeros. O sea, por ejemplo, se ha incrementado because in the Caribbean, en el mar Caribe, había países que le pertenecían como las Guyanas, que le pertenecían a otros países que hoy han sido liberados. ¿Eh? Por eso es, pero son 182 países más o menos los que están establecidos ahorita. Good to know. And how many languages? How many languages? I mean, even, uh, for, uh, son como 490 son la, lenguajes que sean más o menos. Y hay como otros tantos que más... no se han podido diferenciar que todavía son este como, 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 como se les puede decir. They are like a... Uh, ¿Cómo se llama, hombre? Se me ha olvidado. Sí, pero hay una forma, por ejemplo, de decir que no son lenguajes. ¿Ah? Por ejemplo, okay. hay, no sé, en la India, creo, por ejemplo, hay como más o menos otras 10.000 etnias que tienen diferentes formas de hablar y no se han, todavía no se han puesto un lenguaje, porque un lenguaje ya tiene estructura, forma, gramática y todo ese tipo de cosas. That's why. Okay, but the most important are around four, right? I mean, the most important, no, I mean, the, the most spoken, because maybe. The, the most, most spoken. The most language that is spoken around the yeah. world. Chine, the Chinese, as my example, is the first one. English, after I think so, that is Spanish. And after German, French, Portuguese, and da 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 da, da, da. That's all. But the first one is Chinese. Really? Yeah, because they have more people around the world and inside the country. That's why it's the most spoken. After uh, the language that is English, because it's the language that everybody uses for common things like business and everything. And after Spanish, and it depends because, I mean, uh, they were the countries that conquered uh, all the people. That's why they are the spread, the, the, the most spread languages. Okay, good to know. <laughs> Good. Uh, about two thousand dollars. Hey, you got money. Can you lend me? <laughs> no, my family. <laughs> me no. <laughs> Who has two thousand dollars? My grandpa. Ah, your grandpa. Oh my god. Yeah. I was happy. I was thinking that have, were you. I'm not have anything that because mm -hmm. I work. <laughs> you, you you belong to the work class, a la clase trabajadora. That we Trabaj work and work and we don't have money. Trabajamos y trabajamos and we don't have money. <laughs> Esa es la vida de un pobre. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the poor life. Continue, guys, continue. Okay. Ah, yo, yo. 
I tie a bouquet. I I tie a a bouquet. Uh huh. Okay. I'm tired. How, uh, uh, how many cups do do you drink end of the day? A day. Excellent. Uh huh. Uh, uh I tie a bouquet. No, I mean, le está preguntando que cuántas cuántas tazas se toma al día. Uh, yo, yo quiero decir, yo tomo alrededor de tres. I time. Ah, uh, I drink. I drink. Uh, I drink. Esa es la primera. Yo tomo. Eh, uh, 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 you say about. Uh -huh, about three. Cerca de about. tres, más o menos. About, that is como cerca de tres. Uh, okay. mm -hmm. Entonces, también puede decir más o menos o puede decir eh, like eh, más o menos o parecido a dos o sea like two I mean it depends ok ok o puede Thank decir you. puntual va I drink three cups ¿Ah? I o drink el otro or es usually three. que es usually es usualmente quiere decir que no siempre pero algunas veces la mayoría de veces tomo tres tazas cuatro tazas qué sé yo I don't know uh, ok or a couple cups, no, is is right? No. A cup of? A couple cups. A couple. Uh, I mean, ah, uh, a couple cups. Yeah, también un par de tazas. Eso es también a couple cups. Uh -huh. Un par de tazas. Uh -huh. Eso también es una expresión. A couple. A couple cups. Yeah, that's an expression. Yeah, I say to my partner that uh, I like. He, the coffee like you is uh, adding to the coffee. Uh, yeah. I drink have, a you, have you ever tried a Starbucks coffee that is made in French press? You have to try yeah. it. You have yeah. to try it in French press without sugar. And that is like a toll. They call toll. El alto. It's the only coffee that ha have opened my eyes. Like, a... it's the only coffee that me ha abierto los ojos. Y así como que un día, así como que, ¿qué pasó? Y esto que es, it's like ambrosia. <laughs> the, the, French, the French French. Uh -huh. The French press. La prensa francesa. French press. Yeah. The French yeah. press. About y eso que yo lo tomé mediano en sabor, no porque hay uno fuerte. No sé qué me hubiera hecho el fuerte. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Los expresos de, de eh, express. No, express. No. It's in the Starbucks. Express. In express. Ah, in a Starbucks. Yeah, I know the express that is like, like Cubans, like Cubans coffee, que son los expresos así chiquiticos también. Uh. Son, pero, ¿qué? Yes. Una onza, dos onzas, pero. Ajá. Pero es, es como que, yeah, I know. Okay. Oh, my God. I don't want to think about. <laughs> continue, guys, continue. Diana, why you are so quiet, Diana? <laughs> okay, I have to stop. I have to stop. Ever. Uh, yeah. How much take shower today? How much take shower today? Uh -huh. How many days? How many days do you shower per week? ¿Cuántos días a la semana te bañas? Um, Every day. One time. One, one time so week. <laughs> <laughs> Just when it's my turn. Solo cuando es mi turno. <laughs> only when only when run, running. Uh, In, rain. In 18s, in 18s, they were very hard. In 18, in 18, uh, the, the first group, it was very hard because you cannot take a bath. I mean, the way to take a bath in the 18s, it was very, I mean, there was like, just just like a, a bather, I mean, and you have to go one by one in the same water. First the men, after the women, and after the, the, the kids ever. And Diana, you have to think about. Okay, guys. 
I hope so. You have enjoyed the journey. I mean, the breakout rooms and you have enjoyed the time or you have uh, useful your time to make questions, to uh, express different questions, to uh, use the page that I gave you, but also to create questions for you to know, uh, for you to meet uh, everyone. And even you can, uh, you can relate these questions to your work. Okay, now we go to the manual. Okay, I'm gonna share my screen and we go for the manual, okay? Okay, I will be able to request a specific personal finance. Oh my, this is, this, yeah, how often do you have that? This is page 14, yeah, that's it. Okay. Let me see, let me see, Vicky. Hi. You are gonna be Ruth, okay? And I'm gonna okay. be Josh. I'm Ruth, you, Josh. Yeah. Oh. Hey, George. I have a question for you. Do you have find vacation at your job? At your job and have. Do you have? At your job. Exactly. Do you have paid vacation at your job? Yes, I do, Ruth. How about you? Me too. I have. I have. I have. I have. I have. Good. Okay. I have. No, I have. 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 Exactly. I have find vacation. How many days do you have in your vacation? In your vacations. 20 days to be exact. How many bonuses do you have per year, Ruth? I have four bonus. Bonuses. Come on. Bonuses. Okay. I have I have four bonuses. What about you? What about and you? What, what about, about you? you? What about you? And how much do you receive? Do you receive? I have just two, but each bonus is for more than 600, okay? Okay. Expression to ask about money. How much do they pay? ¿Cuánto ellos pagan? Eso es cuando le hagan una entrevista de trabajo, cuando ya, when you can speak in English, cuando usted ya puede hablar inglés, y usted va y pregunta, how much do you pay? ¿Cuánto paga? Okay. Ya usted ya va llevando ese tipo de preguntas. Uh, how much do they charge? ¿Cuánto me cargan? ¿Qué quiere decir eso? Ajá. Uh -huh. how, how much do they charge? ¿Qué es eso? ¿Cuánto le descuenta? Exacto. Los famosos descuentos aquí en our country. Yeah. The is... AFP, AFP, renta. Renta. Okay. That's things. Okay. How much is it? Aquí es como cuánto es eso. A veces ya es cuando usted pregunta cuánto es líquido. Pues es líquido que me van a pagar. Uno dice comúnmente. ¿Cuánto es el líquido? O sea, ya sé que me van a pagar mil pesos. A thousand, okay? They are going to pay me a thousand. But they are going to charge me eh, 400. At the end, they are going to how much is it? They are going to pay me 600. Okay. And after in the USA, uh, almost they always ask about year. How much do you earn every month or monthly? You can see here. How much do you earn every month? ¿Cuánto ganas al mes? A ver, niños, les voy a preguntar. No, no vaya a ser que se enojen conmigo. <laughs> okay. It's a person. Get... It's too personal, okay? Yeah. Too personal. That's the... Teacher. Hi. Okay. Figure it out. Circle the word that best completes the question. How much or how many? Mm -hmm. How much or how many? How many? 
No. How much? Because S. Recuérdense que estamos hablando de dinero. How much do they pay? Cuando es casi oh, siempre dinero está. es how uh -huh. much do they pay. Uh -huh. How much do they pay? Y aquí, how much or how many days? How many? How exactly. Many? How many? Because are talking about dates. Use one of the question about to complete the mini conversation. Okay. Mm -hmm. Veamos. The first Teacher, one. Tengo una duda. Tell me. Uh, en la pregunta donde decía how much, no, sí, eh, de, de, de contar dinero, uh -huh. eh, no, no es how many. ¿A dónde? Eh, donde dice, sí, ahí donde está señalando. Aquí. La primera, ajá. Uh -huh. How much, no. ¿Por qué? Porque es Pero una si cantidad... El, no, para los gringos no. primero no, primero no. Para no. los gringos el money es uncountable, número uno. Y número dos, es una cantidad que no sé. Cuando yo no sé algo que, como el caso de los precios, siempre pregunto how much, porque es algo que no sé, es algo que no puedo cuantificar en el momento. Y como no. ya les dije, para precios generalmente es how much. Ok, entonces... How much do they pay? ¿Cuánto pagan? Huh? Ah, ok. Thank okay. you, You're welcome. Ajá. Uh -huh. Veamos, ¿cuál es la pregunta aquí de estas? How much do they pay? How much is it? Para la primera es... How much? Uh -huh. How much what? Um, how much? How much uh, chairs? How much is it? ¿Por qué? Porque ya me está diciendo, miren, aquí ven. Está poniendo este is. Exacto. How much is it? Ajá. Acá, ¿cuál sería la pregunta? Uh, Ajá. How many days? How many? How many? How many what? Recuérdense que es de estas preguntas, ¿ve? Oh my God. Es how much, como dije que es para acá. Es La pregunta es, how much, sorry, how Acá much, ajá, el medio, un rato. Do you, ajá, do, do you? you earn, por ejemplo, podría ser, do you earn, cuánto ganas, how much do you earn, monthly, ¿Por qué monthly? Porque aquí me está diciendo ya, ¿ves? Tienen que a veces buscar los Q. Algunas veces ya tiene aquí, ya me está dando monthly. Ajá. Entonces, how much do you earn monthly? Eh, hey, me faltó de mar the question mark. How much do you earn monthly? Ah, uh, I make 545 monthly, ¿ok? Siguiente, they take 23 per item. Ajá. Vean, borremos los dibujos. ¿Cuál es la pregunta? ¿Cuál es la pregunta de estas? Para la tercera. How much do they charge? ¿Cuánto cargan? ¿Por qué? Porque esto me está diciendo per item. Per item me está diciendo cuánto carga por ítem. Ah, ¿cuánto cargan por el IS? ¿Cuánto cargan por AFP? ¿Cuánto cargan por renta? Oh. Item es eso, o sea, los items, ¿ok? Entonces es, how much, how much do they charge? Entonces, they take 23 per item, ¿ok? Y entonces, la última, ¿cuál sería? How much, how much, how much, do, they, how much do they pay? Exactly, how much do they pay, ¿ok? 
This is maybe a call center. The company pays 690 with bonuses. Okay. So, listen to your teacher, then read a, with a partner the conversation, okay? Let me see. Ever can drive. I'm gonna be Jeff and you are gonna be Ben. Okay, I'm ready. I am Ben. You are Ben, yeah. Jeff, how are you doing? I want to ask you, how many days a week do you work? I want to ask you. Yeah. Hi, Ben. Well, I work five days a week. And you? That's great. I work four weekdays and sometimes on Saturday. Oh, uh, really? On Saturdays? Do you work extra hours? And how much money do they pay for each extra hour? Yes. I work extra hours when there is too much work to do. Each extra hour is around $10. Y, a, a ver, niños, una expresión americana es cuando usted pide dinero prestado en dólares, you say 10 boxes. ¿Y por qué? No me pregunte, solo es una expresión. Eso es como los salvadoreños que usamos bayunco y si nos preguntan, mire, ¿qué es bayunco? Usted lo sabe, pero no lo sabe definir. ¿Cómo, ah, es, la es? ¿Cómo es la expresión, teacher? 10 boxes. Como box. Boxes, ten como box. cajas, oh. más o menos, 10 boxes. Uh -huh. hey, do you have 10 boxes? Oh, Tiene 10 okay. dólares, algo así como 10 pesos, pues. O sería algo así como el equivalente como 10 pesos. Tener 10 pesos. Hey, you have 10 boxes? Do you have 10 boxes? Eso es así como 10 pesos. Ok, no yes. No traemos churutas y boxes. Ah, ¿perdón? No traemos churutas y boxes. Exacto, mm. churutas, volados, chunches. Exactly, Salvadorian expressions. Yes, I see. Well, sometimes there is not too much time right okay let's gonna see uh -huh. mauricio you are gonna be mario say the word mauricio are you there where are you now absolutely absolutely oh, okay ¿Cómo es? Absolutely. Absolutely. No mucho, le puso una acá. Absolutely. Absolutely. Más o menos. Y está bien, pero muy pronunciada la T. Absolutely. Mm, casi. <ríe> que muy pronunciada la T. Muy, absolutely. Es más suave la TL al final. Absolutely. Excellent. That's okay. Good. Circle the best, circle the word that best completes the questions. How much or how many? How much or how many? How many? How many how hours? Many? Very well. How much or how many do they pay? How, how much? much? How much? Exactly. Because it's about money. How to use how many and how much? How many is used for countable nouns, hours, dates, weeks, years? And how much is used for uncountable nouns, money, time, etc. Okay, that's it. You see there again, I have explained to you that. Instruction, read the sentences and fill out the blanks with many or much. We have done before. Uh -huh. Many or much or much. Many. That is much because it's money, much. Much. Mm -hmm. The first one is much. much. How much money is in a bank? Cuánto dinero hay en un banco? We don't know. Mm. Number two, much or many? Many. Exactly, paper, you can count. How many paper does a printer need? Hours? Many. 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 <laughs> Information? Much. 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 Many. 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 Many.
Many. Many. Many. Excellent. That's it, okay? Let me see, you have to write down a worker. I mean, you have a write down a paragraph. No, we have finished. Okay. Time me for question. No, you can you can do again questions, okay? Just go, I'm gonna go for the attendance. Let us see. Okay, the last time. America Beatriz Garcia Herrera. Present teacher. Bernardo Javier Aquino Menéndez. Diana Gabriela Martínez Escobar. Present teacher. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present. Fátima del Carmen Portillo de Hernández. Present. Flor Idalia Turcio Luna. Dice que no, que lo va, la, lo va a ver ahí. Ok, dice que sí, come on. <laughs> Florida Leoturcio Luna. Present. I'm so sorry, guys. Very good. Francisca Yanira Arevalo Rodríguez. Present teacher. <laughs> Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present teacher. <laughs> come on. Alexander Majano. Present teacher. Nuria Vargas. Present. Abraham Rivera. Hello, witness, present teacher. Okay, pretty good. <laughs> Rocío Martinez. Present teacher. Joana Alvarado. Present teacher. Okay. Zaira Velasquez. Present. Pretty good. Salvador Edgardo Escobar. Sara. Jiménez. Present teacher. Saúl Beltrán. Present teacher. Y Gutiérrez. Present teacher. Yancy Erazo. Present. Soy la González. Yes. Very Present. good. Okay, again, another question. You can use your page. You can use whatever question that you want to ask me. And at the end, Please don't use the same question that you use at the beginning of the class. Please do whatever question you want. If not, I told you it's too personal, okay? Yancy. Yes. Question? Uh... You can use your page or you can use another. I mean, you can use whatever. Use, you, can, you have to use how much, how many, okay. Okay. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> a little moment. A few, please. <laughs> I know. Pero esa pregunta la vi. How, how many? No. Okay. How many tits? Ah, yeah. yeah I know. Uh -huh. uh, how many tits in your, in your body? Uh, tits? I mean, tit. Tit, no es tits. Ok. Tit es un nombre, es, eh, lo explico. Uno es tut. Y dos es okay. tit. How many tit do you have in your body? Thirty-two. I think so. You have thirty-two tit. Ok. How many tit in your body? Yeah. How many tit do you have in your body? Ah, okay. How many teeth do you have in your body? Do you have in your body? Yeah. ¿Cuántos dientes okay. tienes en tu cuerpo? 32. What's the common? Okay. Okay. In, in la boca. Ah, in your mouth. How many teeth do you have in your mouth? Okay. Mouth is in boca. Mouth. Mouth. Yeah. No mouse. Mouth. Eso <laughs> How many teeth in your mouth? No. How in many your teeth? Mouth. <laughs> in... <laughs> In your mama, no, come on, mouse. How many teeth do you have? Mouth. In your mouth. Mouth. Okay. Es como ratón, pero es más uh -huh. una más pronunciada. Es que no es mouse, es mouth. 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 Okay. How many teeth uh, do you have in your mouth? 
Exactly, 32. Okay. Okay. Yeah, Mr. Kandrai. Yeah, Beach. Um, I remember uh, to hear you like the earphone and how many uh, years do you like the team Firpo? Ah, how many years? And uh, why do, do how you... you the, pero de, la pregunta aquí es, how many years have you been following? ¿Cuántos años has estado siguiendo? Have you been following? Firpo. Have you been, have, have you been following? Exacto. Has estado siguiendo. Eh... I got 12, that is 28 years. 28 years. I worked for Tapachuteca, then I saw them training in Vintasa. That's why I, I like them. Okay. It's like me. Uh, I, I like to the team too, because oh, really? I born, I, I front to the, uh, Tierra Blanca, Sultan. Ah, very good. Yeah. yeah. That's why Thank I like in my case. <laughs> Good. Thanks. Welcome, Mr. Beltran. Hi, teacher. Uh, how many car did you have? Uh, just one. Okay. Just one. Thank you. I work as a crazy, but I just have one. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Miss Sara Jimenez. Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. Um, get a bed. How much per car in the bus? In, in the bus? I don't know. Mm, too much. Question, I don't need it. I guess there's some delicacy. Oh, really? <laughs> okay. Okay. Es que yo le dije que si tenía tiempo, la película estaba aburrida, no podía contar. Ah, ok, that's ok. What was the movie? ¿Cuál era la película? What was the movie? No. No, movie. No. Ok. No. No movie. Ok, don't worry. Fátima. Yes. Hi. How many times a month? A mom, sorry. Do you go to the cinema? Uh, how many times? Yeah. Mm, I don't go. Maybe you know that the cinemas are dying. I I don't go to cinema now. I have long time I don't go there. I just watch Netflix. <laughs> okay, me too. <laughs> yeah. Due to the pandemia. Yeah, with the pandemic, yeah, we couldn't go. That's why in this case I saw Netflix. I just watch Netflix. Mm -hmm. Good choice. Thank you. Uh, Miss Arevalo, the chosen one, la elegida para los 10 minutos de hoy. Hi, teacher. Hey, you are walking because you don't want to fall asleep. Huh? Anda caminando porque no quiere caer dormida antes de los 10 minutos. Mm -hmm. so sorry. Yes. Is the is is. Is it true? It's true? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so sorry. <laughs> How many L's in, in the... Dozen? In uh, a dozen? How many eggs are in a dozen? I think so there are 12. I don't know, I'm a teacher. <laughs> I think so that it's true. There are 12 eggs in a dozen. <laughs> Okay. There was there was a yoke, I mean, there was a, <laughs> se los cuento así en español rápido, dicen que en Estados Unidos estaba peleando una señora porque fue a pedir una docena de donas y solo le estaban dando 12 y ella quería 50 donas. <laughs> y le explicaban, señora, pero es que la docena solo tiene 12. No, yo quiero mis 50 donas. I mean, that's why, that's a yoke. <laughs> okay. okay. Jorge Alfredo Argueta. Hi, teacher. Hi. How many stu students are there in the class? Now 18. 
Okay. There are 18 students. Saira. Um, how many? How um, many? How many? Uh, lunares, no me acuerdo, malls. No me acuerdo cómo se okay, so, uh, It depends, I mean, lunares. I don't remember, yeah, but it's mm -hmm. spots or something like that. But it's que algunas es, ajá. Bueno, ajá. Uh, so you have many. Malls. Malls. There are malls. 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 How many malls do you have? Never have counted. <laughs> Maybe like, uh, but I, I have a lot. I think so that every 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 year that you are growing up, I mean, maybe you have more. I mean, I don't know. Maybe twenty. I just have one that I remember that is my year. That is, but I don't know how many. Maybe with the question, I'm gonna count them, or I'm gonna tell to my wife that I have to count. <laughs> because I think so that I can count on my back. Tengo que decirle a alguien que me lo cuente porque creo que no me lo voy a poder contar en la espalda, así en a in a in a mirror. Guys, yo sé que everybody is sleeping. But you know that we have finished, okay? your time you have to do your exercises okay please answer the question that is on the forum tiene que contestar la pregunta que está en el, en el foro todos los días voy a poner una pregunta mañana le pongo una pregunta así este interesante siempre hay preguntas interesantes ustedes saben cuál es el restaurante de comida rápida que ya envió comida al espacio ah bárbaro abraham no <laughs> bárbaro abraham yeah that's it Pizza Hut was, yeah, Pizza Hut was very good, Abraham. Yeah, but the, that's kind of question. I mean, they are questioning in English that you have to answer on the forum, okay? You have to do, do a, your exercise, remember? You have to, I mean, you have to study your manual. You have to be in class tomorrow, okay? Please be in class, okay? Um, <laughs> go to the video and Sé que no participan todos. Recuérdense, mañana empezamos una vez más con estas preguntas para tratar de que los que no han contestado ahorita contesten. And that's all, folks. Eso es todo, amigos. Don't worry, be happy. Live Hakuna Matata. Okay. You, I know that you have to do your exercises, but live Hakuna Matata. Take it easy. The life is life. Okay. Uh, na, 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 na. Life is life. Okay. You have to live very well. Enjoy every moment. Please enjoy your family. Have a good night. Take a good rest, okay? And see you tomorrow at the same time by the same channel, study, and try to practice your English. Bye. Just Francisca, Bye. don't Bye. sleep. Francisca, Bye. don't sleep. Bye. You have to be with me. Bye. 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 Have a nice Bye. night. See you tomorrow. Thank you to be with me. Good night. Good night. Uh -huh, teacher. <laughs> uh, no, no yet. America is there. America is here still. America is still here. Good night. Good night, America. Ayer le toca mañana, dije. Yeah. No le See, you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Okay, Janira, do you have any question here? Ay, teacher, ayer, el día de ayer. De hecho, o sea, estaba tan cansada que me salí como a las 9 y 20. Entonces, la última parte realmente no estuve presente. Mm. Así okay. es que sí tengo dudas porque cuando hice ahora la, la tarea, me costó con las palabras que, que le había dado ayer a usted. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Ah, that's true. I mean, but eh, eh, as, um, I want to share with you again. It mainly this word, mainly this word, this one, okay? Yes. Every yes. day, every week. Y a veces le aparecía una S o una S o una S y por eso creo que ahí se confundía cuál era, ¿verdad? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Yes. Pero estas son basic, basically, the, these are the, the, the words. What do you mean in, 
daily, weekly, monthly, annually. Daily is every day. Weekly is every week. Monthly is oh. every month. Okay, they are the same. Basically, they are the same. Every day, usted dice cada día, pero también puede decir diariamente. Yo expliqué oh. que daily, que justamente LI quiere decir la partícula mente. O sea que aquí, obviamente, para hacer la expresión, pero es día y mente, que se leería diariamente. Aquí no, es semana sí. y mente, que es semanalmente. Aquí es mes y mente, que se leería mensualmente y anualmente. Ah, ok. Sí, es que sí, eso me dio problema para la tarea. I mean, how, how much did you get? ¿Cuánto obtuvo? Um, um, in the first time, um, four. I mean, four? Um, Forty. Forty. No, no. Uh, Eighty. Eighty. Ah, oh, okay. Yes. But even you get good grade. Oh. But it was just guessing, pero era solo adivinando. <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, ah, okay. uh, you were guessing. You were like a team marine de doping. Wey, cucaramaca, no teacher, wey. Exactly, exactly. This is. <laughs> And uh, you start. This is how I do it. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> yes, and then um, I don't uh, like. You say. Yo sé que estaba cansada, pero no tengo que perderme en lo completo de las clases. <risa> Ay, sí, pero es que viera, es que no, estoy yendo a hacer un, estoy haciendo un interinato en un juzgado, entonces cuando uno llega a hacer interinatos así, es más o sea estresante. Que ya, no está, ya no está con América ahorita. Ah, me dio permiso ella. Ah, ok. Porque es un interinato de dos semanas, de hecho termino el lunes, entonces ah, okay. me da permiso cuando es así porque el salario es más. Obvio. Yeah. Entonces, pero bien estresante. Me imagino. Y uno va porque aprende mucho también. Yeah. I imagine. Yes. That's why. But it's very yeah. hard, I mean, to be at the court. And also, I mean, I imagine that you have to help her. Imagino que siempre tiene que ayudarle a ella, aunque le da permiso. Sí, porque me ha tocado estar yendo. Gracias a Dios que está a dos cuadras. Entonces me toca ir al mediodía a firmar documentos, a sacar aquí. Y solo son 40 minutos, entonces. Hey, firmo imagine. y como, y la, la secretaria me está ahí sellando y yo firmo. Ella sí, yo firmo. My God, I imagine. And after you have to be at class, so sorry, Janina, because today was the day, but I mean, but mm -hmm. I appreciate the effort that you do. And I expect, I mean, I, I expect that you, I mean, that, that you learn. Espero que les guste la clase más que todo y que vayan aprendiendo, pues ese es el punto. Sí, la verdad es que sí, yo siempre he querido aprender. Lo que pasa es que como uno no lo practica, por eso es que le cuesta. Exacto. Por, But you are with sí. pero usted está con América, pero es que veo que a América le, le cuesta así como que... Eh. Es que a ella sí le cuesta más porque ella prácticamente nunca ha recibido, pero a mí, como yo ya, ya me gradué ya grande de la universidad, entonces la universidad para graduarse sí pedía 10 módulos. Ah, ok. That's los fine. cuales, como yo, yo había tenido beca para estudiar, entonces yo no podía aplazarlos. Ah, okay. Y cuando yo siempre pedía a alguien que me ayudara y me ayudaban incluso a hacer las tareas, e incluso una vez a un teacher en un módulo que le tuve que decir, porque yo sabía que iba a aplazarlo, entonces le dije yo de que necesitaba la nota porque tenía beca con la universidad y que no podía aplazar un módulo. Which university did you study? En la en the university Catholic University of yeah, El Salvador. Yeah, Catholic University of El Salvador. I mean, that is in, where is it located? ¿Dónde está localizada? En la Luter no, la Luterana es, no. No, la, la es la, eh, la Unicaes la aquí en Santa Unicaes. La Unico. La Unicaes es, yeah. Sorry, yes. la Unicaes, uh -huh. la Universidad Católica uh -huh. de El Salvador, yeah. La yes. Unicaes, yeah. Uh -huh. ah, Entonces, yeah. sí me tenía que forzar. Entonces, sí me costó. Los hice en Spanglish, pero los pasé. <laughs> you practice <laughs> Spanglish. Yes. But now that you are reviewing some topics, that's why it's a kind of easy for you. Yes, 
Por eso fue que ahora que hice la tarea yo, yo cuarto y por qué, donde vi el, la primera nota yo. Porque okay, por eso el claro. primero no me costó mucho. <risa> ok. Pero ahí vamos aprendiendo poco a poquito. Con okay. este tema sí tenía, tenía mucha duda porque pensé que era diferente. Aunque tenía la idea porque Daily sí ya la había escuchado en eso de diariamente. Uh -huh. Pero ya hoy sí ya me queda ah, okay. claro. That's okay. Any other question, Francisca? Mm. I, no. No more question. So no, then no, you no. can ask me at least two or three questions to finish the class. Puede preguntarme dos o tres preguntas, I don't know. Pero no, creo que no tengo. So then just for practice, you can ask me two or three questions. Just for practice. Ah, ah ok. Um, how many? Oh, no. How, how, more, how many uh -huh. check to the email? How, ah, okay. How many times? ¿Cuántas veces? How many times? Okay, how many times check to... Ah, pero ahí le falta el do. Do you check? Ya son como preguntas mm -hmm. más armadas. ¿Cuántas veces revisas tu correo? How many times do you check your email? How many times do you, do you check to email? Exactly. Okay. Maybe, uh, maybe eight times a day when I have a notification on my on my mobile. Cuando ah, tengo una notificación okay. en mi móvil, I I saw the email. So my case. Okay. Uh huh. Um, uh, how many take a shower? <laughs> how many times? How ver, many times? La pregunta take a para cuántas veces es how many times? How y many luego times? hace una pregunta directa. How many times do, do you, you take, take a, a shower? shower? Exactly. Okay. 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 Uh, solo que ahí le falta quizás algo para decir al día o por semana o por mes. How many times? A day, por ejemplo, cuántas veces al día o cuántas uh -huh. veces a la semana. How many times a day? How many times per week? How many times a month? ¿Cuántas veces al mes do you take a shower? Maybe uh -huh. 30 or more than 30. Entonces, así es como se construye esa pregunta. How many times? ¿Cuántas veces al mes, a la semana, ta, ta, ta? Construyes eso. ¿Ok? Uh -huh. Ok. Oh, I have a, a study. <laughs> I, I have to study. I have to. Yo tengo que. I have to. I have to study. Study. Exactly. Okay. You have to study. But it's okay. I mean, you are learning. I mean, and you go step by step. Okay. Don't worry. And have a nice night. Uh, go and rest. I know that you are very tired. Uh, see you tomorrow. And have a nice night. If you don't have any questions, we can finish here. No, teacher. See okay. you tomorrow. <laughs> See you tomorrow, Francisca. Bye. Bye, teacher. Bye.